on that Can't Hold Back album, you sing about wanting to go back and do it all over again. Right, yeah. I want to go back. Right. It's a fan favorite. What do you wish you could go back and do differently, Eddie? Well, if I went back and did it di differently, I would never, uh, you know, I just wasted a lot, a lot of time. You know, going back and having a drug overdose is very tragic, you know. I mean, I mean, there's times when I'm walking through the airport where my ankle swells up like, a, you know, like a softball because, you know, but they say when you play, you pay. You know, and I, the, the fact is that, uh, you know, having a drug overdose and losing the, the use of your right leg for 11 to 12 months and then walking around with a cane for a year was, it was, you know, it, was, it put me in a lot of shock too, you know. But at, at, at the tent, at the same time, and the doctor said to me, yeah, you're gonna be out here copping a year with Lacane. And about a year and a half later, I remember being on, I think I was in Des Moines, Idaho, Iowa, and I was waiting for the man. And I said to myself, that doctor was right. I had the cane, and I was, you know, and I said to myself, what am I doing with myself? But then I, then I met my, my wife, who, who doesn't drink, she doesn't smoke, big cheerleader from, you know, just a fantastic woman. And, and we changed everything around. Because when I became a father, I didn't want my kids growing up thinking that their father was an alcoholic, their father was a, a drug addict. You know, when you raise kids, you want to you wanna do the best to set a good, good example for them. 